Welcome to today's Armstrong Sales Coaching Sales Tip. I would like to talk to you today about some things you can do to grow your business. You know, a lot of people make cold calls and they drop in on people. They might make, you know, have some emails or maybe they naturally get referrals coming into their business, but it's not proactive. I'd like to offer you some maybe obscure but very important ways to grow your business if you think it's appropriate. So I did mention referrals and I have written down here, one thing you can do is proactively ask for referrals. Not a lot of people do it, highly effective if you know how to do it. You can obviously join a bunch of different groups, okay? But are you really looking at networking groups where you're seeing the same people over and over again and you have a good message when you go to these places and you let them help you build your business? Some of you should be doing speaking. You know, you can speak at associations and you can speak at expos and trade shows. There's places to get to get to that you can speak at and they'll allow you to do it on your profession and you can attract people there, but a lot of people won't even think about doing that. Strategic lunches. I like to put together, you might have like in my profession, I might say have an insurance uh, agent and I might have a lawyer and I might have someone that's in mortgages and they're kind of tied together a little bit. So a strategic lunch is just putting them all together at a lunch so we can just you know break bread and talk a little bit about business. Things come up from that. So for some of you, you need to do more lunch and learns where you're educating a company on your services while you're feeding them lunch. Uh, sometimes we need to do uh, referral groups where we get together with uh, 10 people as an example that we handpick that are in similar industries that we meet at and we have a function around that. Sometimes it's even asking people that say no to you. You have not been successful with their organization and you end up asking them for a referral. That can be interesting when you, hey, it may not be a fit for you, but maybe you thought of someone that it would fit better with. Um, we can go on LinkedIn and look for some of our clients that have moved companies and contact them within these new organizations. You know, people, I think there's a lot of ways to grow our business, but we sometimes settle for the same things. We have the same patterns. Look for different ways to grow your business. Practice it, track it, and see if it has any success. And then now you've got something that you can add on to your repertoire. Okay, I hope this little creative meeting helps you. Good luck with it, and thanks for joining.